Alright, hello, hello, everybody. I am Mass, and this is going to be my Portal 2 playthrough. I am really excited. I have already attempted to make this Let's Play. I've made a few more part, a few part, I've played the beginning of this game, but not finished it, that's all. So, it is a semi half blind run. How many of those do you see? <laughs> Probably a lot, actually. Anyway, so without further ado, let's get this started. Adieu, not adieu. Adieu. Okay. Oops. Didn't want to do that. Oops. Um, yeah, okay. So this is what you're going to see is that I'm actually into part 8. Part 7 I've already made, and part 8 I've already made of this Let's Play. So that's in the past, but obviously you're going to see it in the future. So it's actually in a different dimension. Anyway, let's exit again and start a brand new game. And for these first parts, oh, I haven't set my timer off. <laughs> Hold on a second. Let's set this off. Okay. Hopefully this will be okay. Let's play a new game. Brand new game. And starting at the beginning. Yeah, so I've played to the surprise. So hopefully I can play this again the second time faster than I did the first time. Otherwise I'll end up being part get to part six before I've made to part seven. And that just muddles everything up, doesn't it? <laughs> Good morning. You have been in suspension for fifty days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. Yep. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Good. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. This is yes, sir. art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. That's definitely art, all right. You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. If you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. Good. Now please return to your bed. Yeah, yeah, yeah I feel mentally and physically invigorated. So happy. <laughs> Good morning. You have been in suspension for nine, 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 nine. This Hello? Anyone in there? Hold on a second. I'll just turn the sound up a bit. Hello? Are you going to open the door? Yep. Yep. I'm going to open the door. Ah! Oh, Hello. You look um good. Looking good, actually. Are you okay? Are, are you? Well, don't. Answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it. Please seat. prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. All right. Don't move. I'm going to get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. We are experiencing technical difficulties. Hmm. You all right down there? Can you hear me? Hello? Yep. I'm okay. Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although, if you, do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling, because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you just you just jumped. But never mind. Say apple. Apple. Okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. I like how it's All close enough. Core safeguards are now non-functional. Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. Oh, empty fridge. Okay, look. I wasn't going to mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. How are you doing down there? You still holding on? The reserve power ran out, 
So of course the whole relaxation centre stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Hold on, this is a bit tricky. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. Why? It's close. Can you see? Am I going to make it through? Have I got enough space? Yep. Moving uh, right in. Just charge. Just get through here. That's it. <laughs> I, I just can't concentrate. And whose fault do you think it's going to be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Alright, see, so now I hit that one. I hit that one. Okay, listen, we should get our story straight, all right? If anyone asks, and no one's going to ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive, all right? Not dead. Yeah. Okay, almost there. On the other all side right. of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. Ready. Ah, oh, that sound is weird. Good news! Just that is there. not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. Yeah, that sound is actually Almost out there. live. Remember, Just like to add that. Remember, that makes holes. Not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. Oh. Oh. There we go. Now I'll be honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet. But um, at least you're a good jumper. So you got that, you got the jumping on your side. Um, yep. Just do your best and I'll meet you up ahead. Alrighty then. Go team. <laughs> That's the spirit. Hello, and again welcome oh. to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. There I am, shell, jumpsuit, and white shirt. Cube and button based testing remains an important tool for science, even in a dire emergency. If cube and button based testing cause this emergency, don't worry, the odds of this happening twice are very slim. Well, that's good to know, I suppose. I'm going to turn the game sound up just a bit more because it sounds very quiet. Right. Can you still hear me? Yep. Can you still hear me? Alright. Please note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material emancipation grill will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through. Yay, I'm authorized. The first test done. I'm successful. Aha. If you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation drill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Don't want that. Okay. So, grab that. Oh, and yeah, don't do that in front Grab that. And... Run all the way over here. And then run all the way back. <laughs> I'm gonna do this way because too quickly, aren't I? Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing. 
Please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. Well, that is good to know. Excellent. If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to us. Yes. Then what? Oh, God. Oh, God. Hey, hey! You made it! There should be a, a portal device on that podium over there. I can't see it though. Maybe it fell off. Do you want to go and have a quick look? Hmm. Maybe I want to go over here. It's alright, no, go on, just have a look about it. You think it's safe, no, do you? That's right, over by the podium, yeah. Over there. You think that's structurally sound? If, if you just. Okay, just stand by the podium and just look up. Just look up. Just stand by the podium. That's it, yeah, no, that's it, yeah. Yeah? No, oh, okay. I'll trust you. No. Oh! Ah! Damn it. <laughs> Hello? Can you see the portal gun? No. Also, are you alive? If that's yeah. important, should have asked that first. I'm, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to work on the There's assumption that you're still alive, and I'm just going to wait for you up ahead. I'll wait, I'll wait one hour, then I'll come back, and assuming I can locate your dead body, I'll bury you. Alright? Brilliant. Go team! Go team! Hour, hopefully, if you're not dead, Inventors create GLaDOS. Someone screams to defend this cube and everyone dies of that GLaDOS. GLaDOS offers me cake. That person with the cube still there. That person gets the portal gun. And a big picture of Chell. For me. Portal gun! Woo! Alright, half a portal gun. <laughs> Let's go. Computers are all really old for somewhere like Aperture Science. You expect flat screens, wouldn't you? Time is not moving, but 10 to 2. <laughs> These are really old machines for something like Aperture. It's like a portal gun and then those machines. Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robotics. To share. To share. Good. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. That's good to know. Ding! These elevators look very unsafe. <laughs> You wouldn't think they'd run with all that rubble going through them. <laughs> this next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed in three, two, one. Do do do. Right, I'm calling it up here. This is 15 minutes, hopefully. See you next time.